here in Los Angeles, California, shooting a promotional spot for the new DJI Ronin. Today we shot a one-take scene, also known as a one -er. It was very complicated and involved a lot of orchestration. What we were trying to do is fly the camera throughout this building using a single stabilization system, transferring between multiple camera platforms. We start in a conference room where an ad executive is reviewing a script written by a couple of copywriters. The ad executive says that they're playing it too safe, that they need to dream bigger. We fly out of the conference room into another room where a couple of guys get into a brutal fight. And as they fight, our operator attaches the Ronin to a cable rig where it descends one story. And due to the three-axis stabilization of the Ronin, we are able to go from a handheld system to a hanging position where all the yaw, roll, and tilt is effectively in real time canceled out by the three-axis gimbal. A second camera operator goes in, grabs the camera, and continues to shoot the fight scene. We go from that fight scene into another vignette, a soldier embracing his, his girlfriend. The operator in the room then passes the camera through the window to another operator, where we're now outside and shooting a triad gunfight. We then attach the camera to the Sinner Ranger, which is essentially a truck with a crane on it. Normally, doing this kind of setup requires a 90-pound gimbal. Now we are able to, with our hands in the same shot, attach the Ronin to the head of this crane. And you were able to actually go in, lock on, and then fly the whole system. Oh. The Sinner Ranger then accelerates, we fly high, revealing a parkour stuntman doing some stunts, and then end on an ambulance scene. So we're essentially redefining the notion of what it is to operate a camera on set. All I'm responsible for is translating the camera in space, whereas where the camera's targeting, is controlled by someone upstairs who's monitoring what it's seeing on Video Village.